In June, domestic new vehicle sales plummeted by 14% to 40,072 units compared to the previous year, continuing a downward trend that began in August. The Automotive Business Council attributed this decline to the challenging economic conditions in the country with weakened consumer and business demand. Despite the overall market decline, there was a 3.6% increase in built-up vehicle exports. Dealer sales accounted for approximately 82.5% of the total reported industry sales. Chairperson of the National Automobile Dealers Association, Brandon Cohen, provides insights on the situation. South Africa reached the watershed moment in the last few days with the formation of a government of national unity, bringing 11 parties together to forward this country, to look after the people and to not put themselves first. And for a liberation movement like the ANC, losing its majority for the first time in 30 years, this is unheard of on the continent and something that really, really shows the foundation of our constitutional democracy and puts South Africa on such a solid footing. Unfortunately, this wasn't enough to help car sales over the last month. And we were down again compared to 2023. This is the ninth month that we are down in vehicle sales. However, looking forward, even though we are double digits down through passenger right through to heavy commercial vehicles and the banks are taking strain, it just shows you that consumers are very, very worried and they need pressure release such as an interest rate cut.